see, I was, uh, I was thinking that uh, if you tell children, don't do this, don't do that, don't go in for um, salsa dance and don't go in for Western music, they will be drawn to it. The better to give them something as a substitute, draw them away. So we gave them Bhangra dance, we gave them our own Indian um, dances like uh, Bharatanatyam and Kathakali and other exciting dances, as well as our classical music, our bhajans and all that. So we made that part of our curriculum. We started teaching our children this. And from that grew the Bharat Kalachar. We had started a separate wing called the Bharat Kalachar, where our own youngsters who had a lot of talent were given an opportunity to play and dance and demonstrate their abilities and their skills. We also invited great musicians and dancers to perform for our students and to form a, uh, a cultural um, group. And uh, I think from then on, it's now 21 years since Bharat Kalachar was started. That again was my husband's favorite uh, theme. He started it mainly because there were a lot of sabhas in the country, uh, in Tamil Nadu, especially in Madras, which started asking for donations from artists, dancers who came from abroad, any other dancers. They had to pay money to the sabha to dance. Or